My name is Brent. I'm with Subsurface Solutions. I'm out here today to try to find a plastic water line. So what I'm using to do this is the radio, det radio detection electronic transon and fluid conservation systems DX mic. It's what I have on me right here. Uh, this is a, a new model. It's great. I can actually view and I can see the responses over the entire audio spectrum and just pinpoint exactly where I see and hear that sound. And I can measure how much audio there is with a number. It makes this whole process actually pretty quick uh, and very precise. The whole process that we start with is we take the electronic trance on and just hook it up right here, get it nice and tight. water flowing. All right, let it fill the area. And now on this device here, it's just powered with these cell batteries. Just one switch. I got it on. And you can hear the sound that it's making. It's actually, it's generating a really low pitch. This pulse is what we're gonna hear underneath the ground. And it transfers really, really well through the ground. Those lower pitches seem to transfer further. And so, there's a little bit of water coming out this end. Very, very, very minute. And it's really not too noisy on this end. So it's easy for us to even just start to pinpoint this line right off the bat. I listen to the entire audio spectrum and I can hear it. It's pretty faint, but there's a pulsating. And I just try to find that exact frequency. And right now it's telling me here's an audio uh, decibel number of three. I move over closer. can hear it quite a bit more. Now it's at 22. Let's go all the way over here. Oh, I went too far. I'm hearing it at about nine. So I'm gonna move back. Now I'm getting all the way up to 43. Really good signal. Let's see if I can pinpoint it even more. Now, what I'm using right here, oh yeah, I'm up to 50 right now. So this is definitely a spot that I would wanna mark. You're gonna find that in some areas, the frequencies are gonna just shift a little bit through the ground, just how the ground's made up, how deep the line is. Technically, as we get further out, we're gonna to listen to a lower pitch. actually listening between 230 and 330 hertz. I'm at about a 10. Move over right here. I'm at a 21. And I'm all the way down to nine over here. So it's keeping in line. We just keep through the process. So I'm on a really good pitch right now that's nice and low. It's at about 11. I get closer. I got about 13. Now 
Now right in this area, I get right around a 20, right in here. Another easy way to pinpoint where the line is at. We just keep through this process. Sometimes you're gonna hear it a little bit louder, but across the same spectrum as we're going across this line after we have this sort of direction pinpointed, it's really easy to be able to pinpoint exactly where our line's at. So if you have any questions, you can go to www.subsurfacesolutions.com and feel free to give us a shout. Thanks.